Good morning, my friends. It's Tuesday, August 2nd, and I'm here with you at the rising of the sun. And look at this view. The sun is just beginning to rise over the Atlantic Ocean. It's very cloudy, so there's just a glimpse of this light. We continue today in John's Gospel. John the Baptist arrives on the scene in the first chapter and people are asking him, who are you? And John the Baptist has a wonderful answer. He basically turns the focus from himself and says, I'm just the one clearing the way, making a way. The one who is coming after me He's the one you want to look at. We spend a lot of our days thinking about who we are, what we want, whether we're good at what we do, who likes us or doesn't like us, how we're doing at work, how we're doing with our family lives. John wasn't focused on himself. He was focused on the one who came after him. And when people asked him about himself, that's who he pointed to. He knew in the end that his story was just a way for people to find out more about Jesus. It's not that he wasn't important. He was very important, but his role was to point towards the Savior. What if we saw our lives not as successful or failure, healthy or ill, get it, earning money or not earning money, liked or disliked, but as a way to point people to God. And what if when people asked us about ourselves, we ended up turning it towards them and towards their maker? It's very easy to become self-absorbed this day, in this day and age, very easy. But John didn't. He was always about the one who was coming. And interestingly, he was considered by Jesus to be the greatest, probably because he wasn't about himself at all. Let us pray. Almighty God, we thank you for this day. We ask you to bless us today and help us listen to others rather than talking about ourselves. We ask you to guide us today to do your will. We ask you to bless those who are ill. Bless the dying Lord, the hungry, those who are in pain. Bless the grieving, the addicted, the mentally ill. Give us grace, Lord, to be your servants today, to prepare the way for you. Bring peace to this earth and a greater consciousness to all of humanity that we may cherish this beautiful planet that you've given us. All this we pray in the name of Jesus, your son, who is the one who deserves all our attention. Amen. God bless you. Have a great day.